Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Martin here. I hope you're all alright. Um, so this is going to be a gift basket uh, video. Um, it's going to be a sort of a mix up between a spa, pampering uh, evening and a movie night in. So um, some things I already had to hand um, that I've already got. Some things I did buy yesterday. Um, in Sainsbury's and uh, so yeah I'm just going to throw it all together uh, I've got my basket here that I picked up for a pound in Poundland I apologise for the way I look I'm in my dressing gown um, it's five past four in the morning I couldn't sleep so I just thought right I'm going to just get on and do this um, um, also before I get on with the video so I, I am trying to uh, start up my um, homemade gift basket business and um, so it's still early days yet so I've just started up a, a like page on Facebook so please go and uh, check it out it's Marty's so M-A-R-T-Y dot S um, homemade gift baskets I'll um, link the, the the link of it uh, below in the description box so you can click on it and um, I've got 21 members at the moment and it's looking good um, as you know I I do put um, gift baskets together and um, I've uh, been doing them for like Mother's Day for my, for my own mum for her birthday friends you know for Valentine's Christmas birthdays and that kind of thing but some people have suggested that, you know, you should do them and start charging. Um, but uh, so I enjoy making them and um, I'm going to start roughly charging 10 to 15 pound um, for the gift baskets for people. Um, if you have any ideas of what, um, you know, what you want to see, just let me know, you know. I wanted to go for quite a reasonable price you know 10 to 15 pound because that's how much I generally spend on the stuff that I buy um I don't spend any more than that um I think it's quite reasonable um compared to other gift baskets um because I think with my gift baskets you get quite a lot in there and compared to other gift, uh, gift baskets where you go to a really fancy shop and you spend double that you know like 40 to 50 pound like I was in Sainsbury's today and I was looking at the gift baskets and they were like the cheapest was 10 pound but there wasn't much stuff in there um they varied from like 30 the most was about 50 pound and there was about six things in there whereas me I put quite a bit in my gift basket um so I think you're getting well I think you're getting a good deal um you know but um if you are interested in buying a gift basket off me let me know please um that would really really mean a lot please go and check out my um my facebook like facebook like page facebook like page it's marty's homemade gift baskets so please go and check it out and please support my um my facebook um page because that would really mean a lot um i've got a lot of um friends and family behind me especially my friend sophie who's been absolutely bloody brilliant you know she's really like supporting my um you know really behind me and giving me great advice Anyway, well, so further to do, I'm going to get on with the basket. So I'm going to pop you over there. Well, I'm sitting on my very creaky bed. So the DVD I have that I'm going to put in the gift basket, um, I can't remember. Oh, no, I, I brought it from Sainsbury's years ago. So there's three DVDs in there and it was 6 99 I brought it years ago, yeah, and you get three DVDs in there. Right, I'll take, take it out of its box and show you. So there's the three DVDs. There we go. 
and I had this to hand because I had loads of DVDs that I don't watch anymore and um, so I'm not including this in the price so I'm not including it so that's yeah if that makes any sense um, so yeah I bought that ages ago and um, so I had loads of DVDs that I didn't watch anymore and I bagged them all up and I was going to put them, I put them in bags and I was going to take them down to the charity shop. Um, but I haven't got round to doing it because it's really hard because I haven't got transport. Um, but uh, anyway, um, but I thought, say it's going out buying DVDs again, you know, um, and I know that, like you get really good cheap dvds now from poundland but i just thought i had dvds to hand that i don't watch anymore so i'm just gonna literally like incorporate them in the gift basket so yeah here we go so i'll just quickly show you what i've done so i'm gonna tip it up so i've got some tissue paper in the bottom here i've got uh, blue light blue and like a mauvey colour and then I've just topped it off with some dark blue at the top to strengthen it all up. And the good thing about this is it does poke out of the sides a little bit. If I forget to say, uh, please give this a thumbs up if you do like the video. Um, so I will be uploading this to uh, YouTube and I will also be posting it on my uh, Facebook like page, my Marty's homemade gift basket page. Um, sorry, I know I keep banging on about it, but... Um, right. Okay. We've got loads of goodies here um, because I was going to do um, two different baskets. I was going to do one just like a spa themed one, um, a spa pampering themed one. And I was going to do one with just a movie night. And I thought, why not just co incorporate all of it, just do it all together. Um, so if you thing about this is if if there's thing you know if you don't like it you can always change it about you know So I've got the Club Tropicana, is it? Oh no, Cube Tropicana. And I picked that up for 175 today in um, Sainsbury's. I've got the chocolates there as well. got the um, face 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 mask as well just gonna pop that in there I 
I also have the is it the the sour cream and chive dip. Okay, this was on the shelf. This wasn't in the chilled section, as I point that out. So pop that in there. Now I've just got a little bag here that I had to hand, um, I've cut down to size and I've got some tea light candles that I had to hand, I had them uh, a couple of weeks ago, I brought them in, um, where did I buy them, B&M, I think they were one ninety nine. Um So I've just popped four candles in there. Four candles. Hmm. Whenever I say four candles, it always reminds me of the two Ronnies. Four candles, four candles. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> so I've got some twine I've had for a while now. As you can probably tell, I changed. I took my robe off and then put my t-shirt on. Just gonna tie that a couple of times. Okay, where did I put my scissors? So I've got my cello wrap here. I've decided to go with the clear cello wrap so um, people can see, you can see what um, um, what they're getting, you can see inside. Mm. So there you go guys, there's the hamper done. Sorry the lighting is not, it's not brilliant in here. Um, I hope you can see that. Okay, the DVD, the crisps, the bath fizzes, the chocolates, um, popcorn, the dip, chockies and candles that I'd hand. I had to sellotape them down because they kept wriggling about. Um, yeah. And this is coming in at almost just £10. Just, yeah, about £10. So on with the cello wrap. You know, guys, you you guys know how I love my cello wrap, cello wrap, and my curling ribbon as well. So let's do this. Okay. So I'm gonna really go to town with the ribbon. Um, I've got well, I'm literally out, but I'll just show you the empty thing. But you get the gist. Um, I got this for um. Two pound from Hobbycraft, um, so the rest of the ribbon is here in my bag. So I'll just cut some ribbon off there. So I will curl that in a in a moment. Plus this as well. So that's finished now, guys. I just trimmed the top of that and just tied it up the back where. You see all the bits sticking out and stuff, you know. Um, I think I probably could have used more cello wrap. It looks a bit sort of tight up here, but it's not too bad. I don't think it's too bad. Mm. What do you think? Mm. So it's all crammed in there. 
So you can just see what's in there. And then the DVD and the snacks all at the back. And that. curling for me straight away, that's good, that was a good thing. Let's turn you, I'll turn it around so you can see what I'm doing. Never have enough cello wrap and ribbon. Oh, look at that! First time. Fan it out a little bit. There we go. And there we are. So that is one spa pamper evening movie snack night in gift basket um the pampering bits i would say probably candles relaxing sort of um the dvd the bath fizzes and the face mask because everyone likes to do a face mask while they while they're chomping on some snacks so you've got crisp popcorn and a dip to go with it so there we are all done and dusted so i do hope you like it guys um please give me a thumbs up if you do and please comment below leave me a comment and uh, as you know i always reply back to your messages um your comments um and if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please do um don't forget to click the little notification bell and that just lets you know when i've uploaded a video to youtube and it lets you see all my other videos to youtube um and yeah please 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 i can't stress enough please just um go and check out my um facebook like page marty's homemade gift baskets um you know if you like it please you know um send me a request and i'll um and i'll prove your um you know yeah if you ask to join the um the page um i've been most grateful um 
yeah, I can't think what else more to say. I think I've said it all really. Um, yeah, so I'll catch you guys uh, next time. I will be doing a, another one of these um, baskets. I didn't think, um, I didn't realise about, I should have picked up two of these baskets really, but I only picked up one. I don't really, um, yeah, I don't know why I didn't pick up two. But um, I would definitely be on, um, probably on Sunday, because me and my mum go out Sunday, so probably pick up a basket. So, um, so I'll be on tomorrow doing another one of these videos so yeah uh take care guys and i will see you later take care and thanks for all your love and support i'll see you later bye for now